Hello, thanks for choosing First Choice Shipping. In this video, we'll show you how to create a shipment to Amazon UAE. But first, let's create an account. Click on Get Started in the upper right corner to create an account. Select your account type, either business or personal, then enter all of the required details, including your name, email, address, and phone number. Then let us know how you found out about First Choice Shipping. Enter and confirm your password, then click Register. You will then receive an activation email where you will follow the link to complete registration. Once you've logged into your account, on the left-hand side, click Create Label. You will see this pop-up notifying you of dangerous goods that cannot be shipped. Click the checkbox to agree to the notice. When shipping to the UAE, there are additional restrictions that can be seen here. Next, select the Ship From and Ship To addresses. If UAE Amazon is not on your drop-down menu, you can add a new address by clicking your username in the upper right corner and select Address Book. Then click Add Address. You can manually enter the address or click here to add an Amazon address. Then type UAE into the search bar. Check the box next to the address and click Add to Address Book. Now we'll go back to Create Label and select UAE from the Ship To Address dropdown. Next, select the number of boxes that will be shipped and type in the description of goods. The reference on label is for any reference number to be used for your records, such as the FBA number. This is optional. Select the package type, which is boxes in this case. The units of measure can be in pounds and inches, or kilos and centimeters. Next, enter the weight and measurements. Then give each box a reference code. Again, this is for your records and is optional. Click on the gear icon to copy the same information to all of the rows. You can adjust the reference for your own records. Then click next. Now you can select the carrier that you wish to use. The FBA ID number has already been populated from my previous entry. Now I can add an Amazon reference number. Next, you can enter what the items are that are being shipped. Then enter the number of units, price per units, and units by measure, either by the box or by the piece. Next, select the invoice type, either commercial or performa. Then select the terms of sale. Choosing DDP will ensure that the shipment, duty, and taxes will be paid prior to delivery. I'll leave the reason for export as sale. Then select the country of origin for the items, which is China in this case, since that's where they were manufactured. Next, select if you want to add insurance. You can also click the box to schedule a pickup. Then click next. You will get a pop-up saying that this shipment requires approval of first choice shipping. When we receive your request, we'll review the details to make sure that all the fields were entered correctly and your product is okay to ship to UAE. Next, you can submit for approval and the request will be reviewed within 15 minutes if submitted during business hours. Once the request has been approved, you can find the details in the shipment history. If you click the tracking number, you will be redirected to the carrier's website. Click the gear icon on the far right to print the label, print the invoice, email the documents, or view your pickup summary. Here is the shipment label. And here is the commercial invoice. The importer of record is listed here. You want to make sure that all of your shipments have the importer of record. This is $75 per shipment. And that's about it on how to create a shipment to go to Amazon UAE. Thanks for choosing First Choice Shipping.